Business in Vancouver's Tyler Orton joins us now. Tyler, Apple has turned off Face Group FaceTime off the group FaceTime amid reports of a bug. Tell us about this. This is a little yeah. bit crazy. I, it's a little creepy as well. It, this is a bug that allows users to call anyone with FaceTime and then listen in on the audio before the other person has either accepted or rejected the phone call. So not only are there significant privacy concerns, but man, that could lead itself to some very awkward moments. Right now, Apple is saying that they'll have a software update ready for this, but not until later on in the week. So in the meantime, it's best to maybe just shut FaceTime off right now. And I bring this up not because I'm trying to encourage anybody to take action with this, but the bug can be exploited when creating a conference call. I only bring that up to uh, raise the issue of what users should be doing to avoid these sorts of issues, which is why turning off FaceTime is the way to go until Apple actually gets that update out there later on this week. Uh, good advice, I suspect. Thanks so much for that. Uh, okay, a story that's uh, very close to home here. The union representing more than 200 Vancouver art gallery workers has issued 72-hour strike notice. The workers have been without a collective agreement since July of 2017, so we're hearing all this happy news about the Vancouver Art Gallery moving forward with its plans for a new location, and then this happens. Yeah, it's a very bad timing. Uh, and going forward, though, keep in mind that discussions have been going forward for eight months, and it's finally come to this. And I think, I'll be honest, the reason why it's happening right now is because the union and the employers, they are scheduled to meet today and tomorrow, which would mean that the union at least claims that they'll be ready for strike action if fails talk as of Thursday. It's so going forward. The art gallery says that they're continuing to bargain in good faith. And I just say that, hey, if you want to squeeze in a few art gallery viewings in the meantime, you might want to do that now before there's any risk that the support workers could go on strike in any of the coming days. Yeah, that would be a shame. All right. Thanks so much for that, Tyler. Thank you, Colleen.